Okay, I wanna show you guys troubleshooting for when you have a clog in your vacuum. So first, I wanna show you that you can take the wand off from the top and the hose off back here. And this will be one of your first places to check. Um, you just kinda of wanna look in both places, see if you can see a clog on either side. Um, you can kind of shake it out a little bit. Just make sure you're not letting this piece hit the floor. The next piece you're gonna look at is your wand. So we're gonna do the wand release, and you should be able to see straight through the wand if it's clean. If you can't see through it, there's a clog, and we need to get that out. And then the last tube that will get clogged often is your carpet head. So if you move your carpet head to have it straight down, you can see all the way down the hose, and you'll be able to see if there's a clog in there. I would say that's probably the number one reason why people's vacuums stop working. They stop suction and it's because there's a clog.